Hi. It is, let's check the date. Friday, October 22nd at 9.31 a.m. And I am not in Chicago. I'm actually back home. I'm currently back at home visiting my parents and just taking a little break from the city, which is much needed. <laughs> um, I hadn't realized that I had not been home in three months. I left when it was midsummer and now I'm here and it's midfall and that's crazy. I'm headed to meet up with my dad. Um, he left me a note. <laughs> I haven't seen this man yet. Um, he said, Susie, I'm out hiking at the lake. Call me and we'll get coffee. <laughs> and I call him and I say, hey, I'm ready to get coffee. I want to see you. Where are you? Where are you hiking? And <laughs> he says, oh, uh, can you give me 20 minutes? I'm watching this freight come in like a boat. He's watching a boat come in at the state park. So I'm meeting up with him to go watch a boat come in and I couldn't be happier. <laughs> This is a crazy experience. Being in this car right now. Ooh, we have to adjust the seat because it's short. Oh my god! Do I remember how to drive? Okay, uh, I don't have one of those car tripods, so you're just gonna have to deal with my little. Oh, I need to close the garage. I don't have a garage door closing thing. I'm back to driving, and it's weird. Um, he was not exaggerating about the big boat. Oh, oh my God. Okay, so I am back. I did a little fall shopping with my mom because it is getting cold. It is rapidly getting colder and I need to get a bunch of layers. So I went to Target and I went to Dick's Sporting Goods. <laughs> From Target, I'll do Target first. From Target, I got these socks um, because I have some shoes that are a little too big on my feet. I have a very in-between size. I'm like, why am I lifting up my foot as if you can tell that I have weirdly sized feet? Um, I'm kind of like a seven, but I'm also a seven and a half. But seven's too small and seven and a half is like inconsistent. So like sometimes maybe even eight. Moral of the story, I don't know what shoe size I am. If somebody could tell me, that'd be great. 
So I got these socks because I have shoes that are a little bit too big on me. So hopefully by wearing these, the shoes will fit a little better and I will stay warm. That was a very long-winded explanation for something very simple. What else do I have? Oh, so I got this dress at Target. I am not a big dress gal, but this is just basically like wearing a floor-length sweater. It's this really nice color. It's a, it's a great color. How would I describe this? It's like a, uh, um, I don't know how to describe it. It's like a yellow-brown-ish color. <laughs> I got some pens because the ink on all of my other pens run out all the time. I use only pens. I don't use pencils. I don't really use markers. I just, pens are my BFF and they're always running out of ink and so I had to stock up. Um, then, so I want to try this out. I don't know how I feel about it. This is a self tanner. This is the Tanologist Express Tan, Tan Water. I've always tried like a tan mousse, but I'm very curious about a tan water. I'm nervous about it having possibly chemicals in it. So I, I don't know about this. This was kind of an impulse buy, but I'm gonna try it out and hopefully I don't look completely orange. I just want a little, I just want a little color back in my face. Um, then we have the Radically Rejuvenating Niacinamide Serum from Acure. I like Acure. Um, my friend Elise put me on Acure a couple months ago. And I really like their stuff, so I'm very curious. I need, I've been in need of just a basic niacinamide serum. Visibly balance and rejuvenate with niacinamide, zinc, PCA, and hemp seed oil. Just good, it'll make my skin alive again. <laughs> this is this is very like there's kind of a trend of me trying to make my skin feel alive again. <laughs> I think with the seasonal change my skin just starts to be like what's going on? I I don't understand. This is some burst brightening eye gel. Can you you can't even see that. It's too bright. It's way too bright. It's a brightening eye gel. I don't know how I feel about eye serums. I'm very torn because some people in the skincare com com some <laughs> some people in the skincare community swear by them, and other people just say they do nothing. And I don't know how I feel. I'm kind of in between. I don't know. So we'll see. Maybe the vitamin C will be really good for. Rejuvenation. Next, we have this nail color. It's kind of a purple, lilac-y color. I am really drawn to purple right now. Does anyone else go through phases of like color palettes and different colors? Um, maybe it's seasonal. I guess for every season, I kind of have a color that I'm really fixate on. on. I cannot speak today. I always have a color that I'm really fixated on. And I think right now it's purples and browns. I don't know why. I also have the Versed Day Dissolve Cleansing Balm with eucalyptus oil and vitamin E. This I'm very curious about because I've been looking for like a nice makeup remover that's really good for my face. Some makeup removers just strip my like oils, my natural oils in my face. And I'm kind of looking for one that's a little more gentle just because my skin is really sensitive. So it says, soothing oil-based balm that melts into skin, removing makeup and used as a cleanser. And that is it for the skincare. Now on to Dick's Sporting Goods. So, Dick Sporting Goods, I found this jacket and it kind of just felt like wearing a blanket 24-7. I had to get it. 
it's this jacket. It's kind of a puffy quilted material and it's almost a periwinkle but not quite. It's more of a light blue. Um, I have a lot of things in my wardrobe that I feel like I could match with this and I can see myself walking to class swaddled in this all of my morning classes when it's going to be cold and dark still and I don't want to get out of bed I can just wear this and still feel like I'm in my bed next we have this shirt I don't own any brown shirts it looks cropped but in reality on me a cropped shirt is actually it a cropped shirt fits me better because I think I have a really short torso and I'm only 5'3". So everything, like for example, this sweatshirt. The sweatshirt I'm wearing right now is so long. Like every everything is, everything is long on my little 5'3 body. So this, when it's kind of cropped like that, is ideal. It's ideal because it fits me and then I wear high-waisted pants. So it's the cropped shirt with the high-waisted pants. And then it's like, it's like a two thirds thing. So it's like two thirds is the pants and then one third is the shirt. That just makes me happy. And that is visually more appealing than if it was just like half and half. Does that make any sense to anyone that is not in my brain? No. So, love this color. Very big fan. Next we have, oh, I'm very excited about this. It's this Nike kind of, it's like kind of a tank-ish and it's high neck. I have a weird obsession with like high neck things. I don't know what it is. I like, I don't know why. I like when my neck is covered. <laughs> Um, so this is a Nike kind of muscle tank thing. And then I also got these black leggings. I have maybe two other pairs of black leggings, but they're the thing that I wear the most. And like, even though leggings are kind of phasing out, people aren't wearing them as casually as they used to. I'm gonna keep wearing them because they're the most comfortable goddamn thing ever. Um, these are by DSG and I've heard amazing things about them and people seem to really like these leggings. So, very big fan. These are a staple. Honorable mention is this top that I got on Depop. Um, it makes me feel like a 1970s dancing queen. It is this green kind of flowy top. It's a little bit out of my comfort zone, but that's why I like it. I always feel like I should be wearing things where I'm not really sure if it works or not and just like letting it happen. And this works. I tried it on and I loved it. So I'm very excited. <laughs> All right, that is it for my at home fall vlog. I hope that you guys enjoyed and I will make sure to link a lot of the products below. I've tried this one out, the cleansing balm, and it's so nice, so I will link that in the description. If you like this video, make sure to give it a like, make sure to subscribe. I actually uploaded a video that isn't months after my other one, which I'm kinda proud of myself for, but <laughs> anyway, I hope to see you again very soon. And thank you for watching. Farewell.